በኢየሱስ ስም እቅዱ ይፍረስ እቅዱ ይፍረስ ስለ አሜሪካ ካሊ ሰሜን አሜሪካ ካሊፎርኒያ ፕሮፌሲ ስናገር ከኔ ጋር ነበርባችሁ ጌታ ሆይ ያችን ምድር በደም ሸፈን አሜሪካ በደም ትሸፈን እግዚአብሔር ሆይ በዛ ያሉ ቅዱሳን በደም ይሸፈኑ የሉሲፈር እቅድ የሉሲፈር አጀንዳ በናዝሬቱ ጌታ በኢየሱስ ስም ከሸፈ ይሁን እቅዱ ሐሳቡ ሁሉ ይፈረሰ ይሁን በጌታ በኢየሱስ ስም አፍርሻለሁ ም አንድ ከመናፍስቱ ዓለም ኪዳን አዱሶ ይወጣ የሞት መላእክ ያለው ኤንጅል የሞት መላእክ ነው ማየው ቦርደር ቦርደር ይመስለኛል በመንፈሴ ትልቅ ኦሽና ያለው ኦሃም ያለው አንድ ፕሌን ተመቶ ሲወርቃ ያለው ከኢትዮጵያ ውጪ አንድ ፕሌን ተመቶ ሲወርቃ ያለው ቅዱሳን ከኔ ጋር ለደቂ ቃንጸሊ ይሄ የሞት መላእክ በኢየሱስ ስም ቅዱስ እንዲፈርስ እንዳይሳካለት ፕሌን ክራሽ ያርክ ስለማይ ነው በክርስቶስ ኢየሱስ ስም በጣም ብዙ ህዝብ ይጫነ ፕሌን በጣም ትልቅ ፕሌን እንደ ቦይንግ ምናም እንደምትሉት እናንተ በናዝሬቱ ጌታ በኢየሱስ ስም ቅዱስ ይፈርስ በኢየሱስ ስም ይፈርስ በኢየሱስ ስም ይፈርስ በኢየ�usus at least 40 people were killed on sunday when an aircraft of a domestic carrier yet the airline crashed in pokhara in nepal rescue operations are ongoing as hundreds of rescue workers are scouring the hillside crash area there were 72 people on the twin engine atr 72 aircraft operated by nepal's yati airlines including two infants four crew members and 10 foreign nationals It is believed that the plane crashed between the old and new Pokhara airports in central Nepal. According to flight tracking website Flight Radar 24, the plane was 15 years old. Nepal Prime Minister Pushpa Kamal Dahal has called for an emergency cabinet meeting after the crash. <laughs> A 72-seater passenger aircraft crashed on the runway at Pokhara International Airport in Nepal on Sunday, that is 15th January. As per the reports, a total of 68 passengers and four crew members were on board the Yeti Airlines aircraft led by Captain Kamal Kesi that crashed between the old airport and the Pokhara International Airport. Several appeared dead, while the Yeti Airlines said that there is no information about the survivors. Rescue operations are underway and the airport is closed for the time being. Several images and videos of the incident are going viral on social media. In the videos, plumes of smoke can be seen billowing from the crash site. Watch here. According to initial reports, the plane crashed when it was attempting a landing at the Pokhara International Airport amid bad weather conditions. The terrain of the Pokhara Airport is surrounded by hills. Reports further say that the plane caught fire as it crashed on the runway. The company spokesperson Sudarshan Bartola said that efforts are underway to douse the fire caused by the Pokhara plane crash. Government authorities said that they have mobilized security personnel in rescue efforts at the incident site. Details of the casualties are still awaited. Plane crashes in Nepal are very common. Not only domestic flights crash but also foreign ones killing hundreds of people crash. Nepal has also had several serious aviation disasters in the recent years. Over the last 30 years there have been nearly 30 fatal plane crashes in Nepal, the most recent before the Bukhara plane crash today being a Tara air crash in May 2022 killing 22 people on board.